Okay, today I'm going to show you how to make a redstone spaceship. And we're going to put down a block first. Just a support block. There we go, support block. And I'm going to put down a piston, just a regular piston. And I'm going to put down a slime block. And put down a support block that I'm going to later delete. I'm going to put down a slimy piston. Okay, I'm going to go behind that slimy piston, put a regular piston, and put a slime block. Now the one thing I'm missing is redstone. You can do this in survival mode. I'm doing it creative mode just because it's a little easier to float around and show to you. So I'm going to settle down. Go into my inventory and find some redstone. I have a little bit of difficulty finding redstone sometimes. So probably gonna go under the redstone tab there. Pull out some redstone since it's a little easier to find. There's less articles to look through. Nope, that's not it. That's it. come on dude, go ahead and click click. All right, there's the tab. We're gonna, there's the redstone. We're gonna drag some over since I'm in creative mode. I have infinite. You're gonna need three. You're gonna need two regular pistons, two slime, and three redstone. Okay, you'll notice I get some movement when I put that on there. I'm gonna put a glass block. Glass blocks are fairly easy to find. There's my glass block. I should have had all this ready, but I didn't, so be patient. Put a glass block between those two, break that redstone, and off we go. Now you'll, it makes a lot of noise. You'll want to turn your volume down, okay? If you were in the end and you wanted to get to one of the end city islands to explore, this will get you there with a lot less effort if you're in survival mode. Um, this is not my invention. I actually got this from somebody else on YouTube. Uh, there's a picture of my ship off in the distance. There's my new condo off in the distance. And uh, kind of hard to see how this operates from here, so I'm going to lift off and fly a little bit here in just a second. Let you see what it looks like from the side. But like I said, it does make a lot of noise. You'll want to turn your volume down when you start looking for this. Use your mode of transportation. There's a look at it from the side. You can see that basically we're just pushing two groups of blocks along. Okay. The sticky piston helps to keep the center of it together where you're riding. Uh, pretty good form of transportation. It'd take you about five or ten minutes to move a thousand blocks. Uh, most of the end cities that I've found have been up to a thousand sometimes two or three thousand away if you're going for the elusive elytra there and you wanted to get it the real way give you a closer look at my new condo here that i've furnished added a few things since the last time i gave you a tour of my town uh, these condos were here last time but there's a waterfall a couple of waterfalls there dead ahead you can see a brown and white house in the distance that I built. And we're coming up on my favorite two-level condos with the rooftop rose garden. There's the rooftop rose garden. See my church off in the distance there. Here's my new mansion. I'll have to post a video of a tour of the inside of the mansion with carpet and painted walls. There's the church that I built. Use armor stands for my crosses. And I'm about ready to tear that house down because I'm really not happy with the way that house turned out. But there's my lovely little village that 